How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's getting out and enjoying this warm weather. Although it could just be located around my area. So if you're still getting snow, I'm sorry. It's going to be a little bit of a rub in right now. I got some uh, plans, upcoming plans that I'd like to talk about. Try to get out there. So stick around, find out what I'm talking about. I kind of wanted to go to Daytona, but at the time I didn't have enough planned out. It was like a last second thing and I was like, ah, forget it, I ain't going. And with uh, somebody that I'm super loyal to is working their rear ends off at the rallies. I'm gonna, as long as everything pans out on, on dates and you know everything's good on their end and all that, I'm gonna go to Myrtle Beach Bike Week at least for two days, maybe longer if they want me to stick around longer. But uh, I think he uh, needs an extra hand with some footage because I know what he's doing is tedious and tying him up, which is understandable. But I don't want him to uh, fall out of the groove because he's tied up all the time. So I'm going to do my best to go and take over his channel temporarily. Help him out, get him some more content. And maybe I know I'll have plenty of content there. I know he was worried about me getting content, which I'm not really worried about getting content because I'll make it happen either way. So if y'all are planning on going to Myrtle Beach, um, and y'all want to do a stop by, say hey, uh, go to my Instagram. Tweedle underscore D underscore TN when I get there and have more you know figure out what the plans I'll uh, I'll put it on that that way that probably be the quickest and easiest way for uh, somebody to find out and I'm also going to be at an event for uh, Traveling Tall. Uh, I think it's 10th, 11th, 12th he's doing a thing of June. I know he's doing a banquet on the first night and then it's going to be a big meet and greet on Saturday and a ride. Sunday he's got something else planned and I don't remember what that was and if I did uh, that individual needs to say it not me <laughs> but I will be going to that I know there's a couple other creators that are local to me that will should be going so if y'all are since we live all right here together uh, if y'all want to meet up and ride on out to bootlegger for it let me know we'll come up with a time and a time and a place to meet up and I also have something else well I ordered my oil I'm gonna replace this line this week since I plan on going to Myrtle Beach I don't want to get halfway there and it starts seeping oil so it looks like it's going to be in showing friday to monday so i got to look at weather and all that it may be out on wednesday next week it may be a day late 
just depends on weather and how everything's going because they're showing they're supposed to be raining today from what i seen on the radar yesterday and there's no rain at all so i guess it sped up or fell apart so i'm gonna take advantage of today and do a video I already done two other ones but i uh actually yeah i did too i deleted one of them to do this one i didn't even put it on my computer actually no i think i did three other ones and deleted the third one so <laughs> i'm getting real bad at that i'm probably messing myself over by doing that because i do have an idea of how i can reuse that footage and talk about something else Oh, you know what? I don't want to go this way. I want to go this way. Because I'm headed towards Clinton. See if uh, old DDK is out riding around. which in this instance he'll know it's me because i got my own shirt on today <laughs> i uh probably will be doing more shirts in the future as i grow bigger i don't really see a sense in spending several hundred dollars on getting shirts made and them just sit there so If anybody's watching and wants shirts, let me know if I get enough of them up that I can do a small order that won't cost me an arm and a leg. I'll uh, I'll make them and try to uh, do my best to keep it a reasonable price. That's one thing hard. I've noticed ordering small quantities of shirts. I think the one I got on pretty much cost me $35. And I ordered two. <laughs> so I gotta find a way to get that number lower. That way I'm only, you know, shipping and all that. I'm I don't want to go over 20 bucks. I mean if it goes over a couple dollars, I don't think it'd be a big deal. But I don't want to have an expensive t-shirt because money don't grow on trees. I know that just like everybody else. And want to keep it affordable. Now, I will say if I uh, my plans do plan out and I get to go to Myrtle Beach which are looking good I'm probably only going to have 100 or so stickers to give away so I'm going to order more for the Traveling Tall event because everybody loves stickers and they're uh, one of those items that I consider uh advertising so i'm not gonna sell stickers i know some people will probably say i should but there's certain things that are like giveaway stuff and to me that's one of those things so this video i'm gonna be doing on my oil line drain there's two different ways of doing it. There's screw type clamps and then the factory clamps that are pinch type. Um, I've looked and noticed the three, or actually there's four, three hole oil changes I watched. Three of them didn't do it right. 
uh, they didn't use any lube on their O-rings. And one of them didn't even put oil in the oil filter. So my question to the audience is, uh, I know it's probably only gonna be maybe 20 views before I do this coming video. Should I go ahead and do this line and do a correct three hole oil change? because that's the last thing you want to do is watch one of those videos and throw some dry o-rings on and you know a couple months later you start leaking oil out on your back tire they could come out to a bad situation really quick but seeing how that's a redundant video it seems like everybody does it my question is should i because there's another thing I noticed too that two of them didn't even stand their bikes up while it was draining to get all the oil out. So they still had oil and contaminants in their bike because it was on the kickstand. And I'm not gonna say who those guys were. I doubt they watch my channel, but if they do, they probably already know who they are. <laughs> I didn't call them out on it or nothing, but just from the description I've been given you already know if you did it you already know who I'm talking about because you're watching so leave me a comment down there give me a uh, let's do this yes for a three hole oil change with the drain hose replacement or no and it'd just be a drain hose replacement what would y'all like to see because i know i can't make everybody happy uh, slow people I know I can't make everybody happy, but I want to try to do the best I can with my footage that appeals to everybody. I know that's going to be really hard to do because no two people agree on every same issue. I just want some input. I've got some from a couple other YouTubers. They were just like, change the drain line. But then I looked into the videos that was out and pick that up really quick and I don't know it just it's one of those things that been kind of bothering me should I go ahead and do a video and do one put one out that's a hundred percent correct or should I just not say nothing and do my my old line replacement yeah I'm riding into Clinton like DDK is going to be out on the side of the road or something. <laughs> I got no clue where he lives. I know he lives in Clinton, but I don't know where. <laughs> and he's probably watching this video like, dude, you passed my house. <laughs> or here in a couple minutes they'll be like you just passed my house why didn't you stop i didn't know i'm gonna go ahead and ask this question too um, seeing how tennessee whew, just has some grass go up my nose or something i'm going to sneeze Seeing how I'm in East Tennessee, uh, if there's any specific roads like Chihuahua Skyway, I really don't want to go do the Tail of the Dragon. It's kind of overrated. Uh, Foothills Parkway, uh, what's that one? The Hellbender, I think, was the other. There's several other roads that are 
less known and if you know of them um, you can either leave it in the comments or email me at tweedledetn at gmail.com and I'll uh I'll get some roots planned and um, go hit some of those roads if you want to see them on here because I know there's still some that I have no clue about that I hadn't heard of a road so if you can give me specifics definitely email me that and I will uh, plan out a trip for that and go knock some of these roads out on good days it's like today if there's any kind of a uh, specific content you want to see and I may not be thinking of it uh, you can either put it in the comments or like I said email me at tweedledetn.com or you can go on my Instagram tweedle underscore d underscore tn find me on there and send me a message there yeah hit me up on one of those two and uh, I'll see what I can do to make that content happen I do uh, I do have other installs like I said before I'm gonna do the tuner and the exhaust here hopefully this year I'll be able to afford to do that that's a uh, probably gonna be a little over two grand so I got a ways to go And that's with me doing it myself because the exhaust I picked out is uh, perfect in my eyes. Is it worth the amount they want for it? Probably not, but that's the one I want and that's the one I'm going to get. I'm just hoping that it's pretty loud. So, I guess what I'm going to do is end the video here. Uh, please, hey, y'all drop comments down. And uh, I'll try to make that happen or, you know, hit my my Instagram or emails up. Um, next week, videos should be the oil change. Definitely going to be the hose line replacement. So, that's going to be an install video. Um... And then the following week, as long as everything plays out, I'll have some uh, content from coming and going and at Myrtle Beach. And you'll probably end up seeing me on another channel because I'm gonna go take his over. <laughs> and he's cool enough, he don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna make it good for him. He told me to use it for my channel. I was like, nah. It coming out on your channel is way better. So, like, comment, subscribe. You know the thing. And I'll see you next week on an install video. Keep your two wheels down. Go out and enjoy some riding. I'll see you on the next one.